So your assignment today, besides working on your restaurant menu, is to start getting used to the uh, to the Friesen's interface. So I've logged in here. Uh, this is my daughter's account. And the first thing I'm going to do is hit launch. And this is going to launch this. Now I want to, uh, I'm going to start building it. So I'm going to hit build it. And that brings up the screen. And as you can see, this is what our yearbook looks like right now. Every, each of you has been assigned a spread. So like here's Joseph's spread, pages 26, 27. If I try to go into this, I get this message. You can only edit pages assigned to you. So each of you has been assigned pages. Here's Ava's pages. So I'm going to click this little pencil, and this is going to bring up this interface. So you can see that there's a template applied. Here is your bleed area. So if you have a background, it has to go to here. This is your gutter, so you should not go into the yellow thing. The pink areas, that are those are your margins, so you shouldn't have any text that goes out of there. Uh, this is where it's going to be cut, so don't um, go near, don't put graphics that can't be cut right near there. And the green things, those are your column views, which just help you in terms of organizing your page. So everything we're going to use as one grid space apart from each other uh, in terms of organization. This is just the line that's in here from the template. So the first thing you're going to do when you want to design your page is you're going to go to Templates. You're going to find this one that says for first assignment. You can see there's a whole bunch, but for first assignment and the below the template, and then you hit Apply. I'm not going to do that here because it's already on here. So this is just a placeholder. So you can write whatever you want. You can change the uh, font here, the font size, all that stuff. This is where you can play with your thing. Here's your assignment for today. You're going to go to Images, which is here. You can see Ava's already uploaded six images. So what I want you to do today is create one new folder and that put at least one picture in. Okay, It can be of anything today. It's just to get you used to it. So I'm going to click Upload Photos. I'm going to add a category. We're going to call this Ava Folder 2. Okay, and we I'm doing this so that when we have 30 or 50 folders in here, you'll know which one is yours. So name it with your name and hit save. Okay, now there's nothing in here. So I'm going to say browse files. And like I said, I'll find some pictures of Ava. So this is from a birthday party. I'll just take these three at random. You can hit, you can select more than one. Notice that they're all JPEG files. The only types you can do are JPEG and TIFF. And then I hit open. And it's going to ask where do you want, sometimes it asks you where you want it to go to. Make sure you're in the right folder. And then just hit start upload. And now they are going in. So you'll see complete once they're all done. Okay. And there they are. So now you've got your pictures in. And you can just put them on your page. And then this is where you can start playing with them. So. What I would just recommend is for now, just start playing with this interface, figure out how to do it. If you want to actually change it in the frame, look at you can change the shape to a circle. And then if you double click it, you can resize it. So that's how you crop. And there you go. So then I click off of it and I've got this nice image. And now I can move it around and stuff like that. So that's what I want you to do. You're going to create an uh, image category and then you're going to put at least one photo in your folder and then once it's done make sure you hit save and it's now uploaded to Friesens and then tonight when I check it I'll know you've done it. Thank you very much.